Hey guys, what's up? It's Ryan here, and today we are going to be doing a quick little tutorial or how to video on how to get the screensavers from Apple TV 4 on your Windows computer and Mac. Um, it's pretty cool. The aerial screensavers are really nice just for show, and uh, yeah, so I'll show you how to get them on your own computer. So, first one you want to do is go into your browser here. I'll put both of these links down in the description. They have one for Windows and then one for Mac. You can see there, and that's what it'll look like on your Mac. It looks really nice. And uh, Windows. All you have to do is go do hit download zip, download the zip folder, and then un unzip it into this folder <coughs> and open it up. Go into install and ignore Don't open the exe, don't open SCR. But what you want to do is right click on SCR and hit install. And once that's done, it'll open up control panel with personalization all that stuff it'll do it automatically I'm just gonna go to it manually just screen save oh wrong one we'll just, we'll just do uh, screensaver <clears throat> as you can see here it's set the aerial screensaver version 3 um, there's no preview because I'm recording when it records it tends to lag I don't know why it just does um, I'm going to see if it works uh, if I hit preview. So I'm going to turn off my face cam really quick. And I will hit preview. Let's see. Hold, hold on. Not responding. <laughs> preview. Alright, let's see if this works. It takes longer to, to load than usual. When you're not recording, this isn't going to happen. It's going to load in immediately like that snap of finger. So um, don't worry about it taking too long to load in. Only when you're recording, it's going to take a while. So there you go. As you can see, there's the animated video. Now they're going to freeze a couple times. They're going to start freezing and going because I'm recording. Like I said, um, it causes it to lag. But when you're not recording, when you install it on your own computer, you're not going to have the problem. It's going to be continuous flowing video it's not going to freeze up and stuff like this so but that's what it's going to look like it's going to be panorama type of uh, aerial cinematic views of landscapes and it looks really nice this is uh, I think this is San Francisco um, of course that's where Apple's from so that's where, head that's where their headquarters are but yeah that is how to get the screensaver on Windows um, you can have, there's many options too it's more customizable on math, Mac since it is Apple, obviously, but they have it for Windows too. Um, Mac allows you to choose what videos you want and don't want in, in the screensaver and um, choose how often they change and all that stuff. I'll show you it um, after this. So you can also set it to, if you have two monitors like I do, um, you can set it uh, one video on one monitor, one video on other. So this other monitor you can't see has clouds on it which looks really nice and then obviously you can see this one has a city on it um, San Francisco so yeah that is how to do it on Windows hope you enjoyed that um, I'm gonna quickly switch over to Mac and show you how to do it there so I'll see you on my Mac now I'm on my MacBook um, and I'm gonna show you how to get it on Mac it's basically the same steps I just want to show you just to make sure so we're gonna just go to Chrome again and we're gonna do Apple TV aerial screensaver for Mac. Okay, we have it right here. This is the same thing. I'll just put down the links in the description, like I said. Um, all you do is hit download zip. I'm doing it on here because I have not installed it on here yet. So that's why I'm doing it. Open it up. Of course, it's going to extract the folder, and we're going to just put it on the desktop just to show you really quick. Now we're going to go into Aerial Master like that, and all you have to do, same exact thing, but a little different from Windows. You don't have to right click and do install, just double click on Aerial.Saver. And if it your, <laughs> I forgot to do this. If your Mac complains that it's from an unidentified unidentified developer, go into Apple System Preferences, and you want to go into Security and Privacy. You want to go to General, and you want to do. I'm going to click the lock. Um, that I'll just do it from anywhere. I don't care. Just lock that. 
Okay, now we're going to go to double click Arial.Saver again. It's going to work. Install for all using and ask you for either user. I'm just going to do for all. Hit install. Type your password. And it just installs for you. And then it just opens it up. And you can scroll down here. And there it is, Arial. It's way more customizable on Mac. Um, it's probably not going to lag because it's Mac. Because I'm recording on my computer and it's just, I don't know. Uh, Windows logic. <laughs> you can do screensaver options. You can see you can choose what videos you want to include and you don't want to include. So you can they actually give you. Um, you can click on them and they give you a preview of them right here. So you can see there's the Great Wall of China. This is China. Day two three. And then there's Hawaii. Is that actually might lag? Never mind. Like I said, it's not gonna lag on your computer since you're not doing anything. Um, and you can set, you can do cache. You can actually cache all your stuff, so it won't have to load every time. So as they play through, you can let them cache through. I don't know, but done. Let's do a preview. Hopefully, you guys can see it. All right. So as you can see, here it is. Here is the preview. It looks pretty nice. You can see the cars down on the street there or the Golden Gate Bridge. Let's try to find a more clearer one here. Um, let's see. You can go back. There we go. Okay. So here's a city. I don't know what city this is. It might be San Francisco. I'm not sure. Or is... Uh, no, it's New York. Sorry. It's New York. Um, so I can see the rivers and stuff around it. Yeah, this is New York. Um, but yeah, this is another example of one of the cool screensavers you can get. So it's pretty cool. Um, I like it. Looks really nice. They're in like between 720 and 1080p, so it looks pretty nice. So I hope you enjoyed that. Um, so yeah, that is how you can get uh, aerial screensavers on your computer from Apple TV 4. Um, I'll put the links down in the description so you can download the stuff. Um, just comment down below if you have any questions. Um, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Uh, and that's it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Thanks.